Our fighters are ready to lay it all on the line. All right, you ready? No mercy for you. Round one, fight. Let's see what they try to do here in the first round. Goes for the throw. Side switch. Now they're on the defensive. It does not want to get stuck in the corner. Player two is the life lead. The throw hits. Now the fun begins. Steps in for the throw. So they break forward to pressure the opponent. Difficult situation for a throw. Time's the only thing moving here. Both fighters may be looking to risk going in with an empty SA gauge so they can fill it quickly. Projectile to try and change the situation. It somehow pushes back all the way to center stage. It's like KO. What? Player two on the boards first with the win. They'll want to keep the pressure on. How will they take advantage of everything that's happened up until now? The jump in catches them. Scrapping it out up close. The opening on that impact. Will they take it? Handle is there. You can't drop drive impacts. Breaks the block with a throw. Fights out of the corner, back to the center of the stage. What'll happen here? Not close enough for the throw. Excellent block. That's a big gap. Who's going to crown them from above? Watching each other carefully. Who will make the first move? This is gonna hurt. Blocking that drive impact isn't going to work. What? They're going for the super arc? Player two can't let this simmer. They got the oh, yo, raw super here. Oh my god, what's gonna happen? What are they gonna do? This can lead to some big damage. Flat line zone. Last round, people. Both fighters gotta go all in from this point. Open pump some hard. This is it. Who can pump the brakes on the impact? Rising uppercut. Both players will knock them out of the air. They just said, get that jumping out of here. Serve them a knuckle sandwich. Player two is in a pit. Nothing stops this train. Connects with the pro. What's next? Jump. Oh my god, they just jumped it up. Player two goes airborne. Drive it back. This is cool. What a smart play. Noticeable life lead is a comeback. I called it! I called it! A jump? They pushed their way out of the corner. What are they gonna get them in the air? Player one really had to fight for that one. No shortage of drama. It's not over yet. Best believe it's time for that run back. Knockdown. Here comes the mix up. Goes for the jump in. Hits him with a stop and pop. Burnout is triggered. What's the play here? Player one needs to deal with this burnout. Okay, creating some space here. Player one doesn't have a lot of drive gauge to play with. Not a good thing. Big counter. Checks him with the projectile. Player two creates a good corner opportunity. The punish counter gives them a great opening here too. And the throw ends the round. Player one takes the round like a thief in the night. What else can they get away with? Everything up until now, and everything from here on out, is so vital. Absorbs the attack and fires back. Early round decisions are so experiencing burnout. Player one in dire straits with burnout. Oh, can they survive this badly timed burnout? Player one doesn't have a lot of drive gauge to play with. Not a good thing. We have one player in burnout state, which means they'll have to continue the fight temporarily without using any drive reliant moves. Player two will look to apply pressure here. They gotta be careful not to overextend or their opponent might go for a fight. Both fighters have a full super meter on deck. With a super art? Ugh, just go for it at this range. There's the drive impact that's going to lead to a juicy punish time. Racer hit, we're gonna see it rain. And they create an opportunity for themselves to seal the deal. Their spacing is so on point right now. But who's gonna blink first? They return to center stage. So, what's next? This can lead to some big damage. Sticks out a kick. What a finish!
Player one brings it home. Let's see if they can build themselves a streak. 